Hey guys, it's Daniel. Welcome back to another video. So the package, I mean the figures that I ordered from Japan finally arrived. As you can see right here, it's in this box of like the LBC. So the uh, these are, I think there's two figures inside. Um, one of them still has a box, but let's just uh, remove it from the box first. Okay, so uh, these the, these figures uh, were shipped. Um, they were out of the box, so like to save on shipping, they just folded the box. So I just uh, put back the box on how it was used to be. So yeah. Oh wait, I actually forgot the light. Hang on, let me just fix it. Okay, so as you can see here, here we have the uh, box of one of the figures. So first we're going to be taking a look at this To Love Ru figure. Um, which is, I think it's Yuki Mikan. I think that's her name. Oh yeah, right there, right there. Yuki Mikan. So I've seen clips of To Love Ru, but I haven't actually started watching it. But I, I am planning soon. You can see right there, this is a special figure. I think this is the uh, sister of the male protagonist. So yeah, um... Next, we're going to be looking at this box here, which is Megumin's box. So, I'm not sure what version is this because I can't read Japanese. But this is kind of like my, I think, yeah, it's kind of like my Rem figure before. Where he's like in this Egyptian like outfit or something. So yeah, uh, now let's take a look at the figures. Let me just put the boxes aside. So they come in bubble wrap which is nice and also this one here and there is a freebie of like this tea I think it's a tea I'm not sure okay so um, the I don't know the clamshell or something of this is kind of like not really broken but it's really it's folded but they pack the figure well since it's from overseas you have to pack it really well it was kind of hard to open but it's okay this figure is all right there is no damage whatsoever hopefully so as you can see right there now let's um remove the figure from the shell okay so first let's look uh let's take a look at the base of this megamine figure that i have so it's just a pretty standard base there is a okay so as you can see here it says uh, konosuba which is this is the logo of the anime you can see right there and then here is the, I don't know if you can see it, the mark, as you can see right there, it's kind of being glared on by the light. So yeah, just a pretty standard base, actually a bit thick, and this is just made of plastic. It's high quality though, so that's nice. And then we have the figure right here, let me just remove it from this plastic wrap. Okay, here we have the figure itself. So now let's take a closer look. First, let's look at the face. They did a pretty good job on the face. There is no paint chips. So as you can see, Megamine is it's kind of like blushing. And she has this pose right here. And here's the back of her hair. Right there. Okay, there is some paint chips on the back. That's okay. Now you can see this thing here, like this kind of like translucent um, cloth or something. And then I noticed that there is... Uh... Okay, so I have the figure right here. As you can see, her face looks really cute. And then she has she's kind of blushing as well. There is no errors on the face. The eyes are painted pretty well. And here's the back of her hair. She has this kind of pose as well. There is some paint chips on the back as you can see right there i'm not sure if you can really see it though and then i noticed that there's something like on her tummy as you can see right there it's kind of like a, uh, a dent or something but that's okay it's, it's kind of noticeable but it's not that noticeable and then here we have the uh body of the figure as you can see it's kind of wearing this like um egyptian style or something 
clothing and here we have the bottom of the figure there is okay so the bottom of the figure has some details as well as you can see uh, the design on this thing here is really well made there is some folds as well and on the back we have it here as well then she has this kind of like uh, uh, strap on her leg and then on her uh, right ankle as well and then the pegs is right here it's kind, of it's kind of translucent as well it's not wearing anything now let's put it on the base so we can properly see how does it look like just stick it properly there we go and the other one there we go okay so yeah this is how the megaman figure looks like i can't i put it like straight up because it doesn't fit my screen this is how it looks like looks really nice and now let's take a look at the uh to love Rue figure also in a bubble wrap so let me just remove that okay now let me just remove them from the plastic wrap first let's take a look at the base as always so it's actually a pretty standard plain white base as you can see right here but the shape is not entirely like completely circled there is uh some like curved edge on the hang on sun it's not focusing so the edge is curved as you can see right here it's not completely like flat so this is how the base looks like it's just plain and then here's the markings on the back now let's take a look at the figure it's actually really small but that's okay it's from the plastic wrap okay so here it is let me just fix my light for a second there we go so um i was kind of like almost disappointed because i searched how does this figure look like like on youtube where they did like some unboxings but probably just on like the video but it, this actually looks really nice even though it's uh, just a very small figure so let's take a look at her face as you can see right here um good paint job on the eyes there is some blushes as well there is uh okay so that was just dust so yeah, they did nice details on the hair as well as you can see and then we have her um i don't know if this is called a ponytail but i think on the anime she has that as well the shading on the hair was well is well done as well then she has this like happy pose or something and she has her apron and here's the back of the figure Here's the bottom. So they did so they did great on the clothing as well. You can see there is a lot of details. There is shading as well. That's cool. And then she's not wearing anything on her uh, feet. There's no shoes or like slippers or whatever. So yeah, this is a very simple figure, but it looks really nice. Let me put it on the base real quick. there we go so this doesn't uh, fit my screen as well so i'm just going to show it to you like on an angle so this is how it looks like again very very nice right there and yep that's the end of this unboxing video so this these are the two figures that i got from japan so i'm very satisfied with my order if you guys want to order i guess i'm going to try to trade the link there um page on the description so if you want to see more make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel turn on post notifications so you'll be notified whenever i upload a new video thanks for watching and peace out